Lady. The driver is Ron Waples. She's a great lady, too. John Campbell driving for the Linda and Lee DeVisser partnership. EDI Stables, Chris Christopheru, share ownership of number three, F. Tamiya, with Chris Christopheru Jr. driving. Four is Maddie's Image, with Tony Kerwood to drive, owners Emmanuel Mizzy, Alice Lee, Simon Wong, and Dave Tingley. Five is Swingback, Kelly Shepard driving, for owner Carol McWilliams. Six headline Hanover, Doug Brown on the bike for the Robert Grand Holdings. Carl Jamison co-owns and drives number seven, Elegant Killeen, co-owners Dolores Lawrence and Jacques Roy. Jackie and Jerry Dinell, Michael Spooner, Ross Gibson, share ownership at number eight. Who's and Dawes, the driver, is Mike Saftig. And completing the field, number nine, Tricky Tushi, owned by Luis Ecuri El Senor Bino, with Rick Zeron aboard. Contested every year at Mohawk Raceway since the spring of 1963. It's the 34th annual and 1996 Milton Stakes. The purse is $150,000. The 1996 and 34th annual Milton Stakes. The field is in the backstretch and there they go. They're off and pacing. Uh, she's a great lady is going to fire early. F. Timia goes on. Up on the outside, headline Hanover is leaving hard. So is swing back. Nines wild along the inside. And elegant Killeen is wide from sex. Tricky Tushi back there in seventh. Moving eighth into the first turn was Maddie's image and do's and Dawes. Headline Hanover a little bit rough and four wide in the first turn. Swing back is still three wide. Nines wild following in. They're all pursuing. She's a great lady. Up front at the quarter in 27 and one. She's a great lady on top, a length and a half. Nines Wild is second. Swing back has got to stay out there. From third and Tricky Tushi closes up in fourth. Elegant Killeen fifth on the outside. F. Timia is sixth. Headline Hanover taken in Randy Race from seventh and Maddie's Image and trailing is Ooze and Oz. She's a great lady in command of this field. Nines Wild following in. Swing back has got to go overland. Tricky Tushi following to the inside. Fourth Elegant Killeen is fifth. F Timia sixth off a half in 55 and three. She's a great lady in top stride. Opens it out to a two length advantage coming inside the final three eighths and she's drawing away on this field. Following along in second is Nines Wild. Tricky Tushi third. Swing back under urging, not responding from fourth. Elegant Killeen is fifth. Maddie's image three deep from sixth. Then F Timia headline Hanover and on the outside Oozendaz trails. But she's a great lady. Yeah.
is putting on an awesome display. She's off by almost 10 lengths at the top of the stretch. 122 and 3. The track record is 152 and 2. She's a great lady with a huge lead into the lane. Nines Wild and Tricky Tushi. Ooz and Oz picks up fourth. It's She's a great lady winning the Milton Stakes. 152, a track record. Tricky Tushi second. Photo for third. Ooz and Oz against a Nines Wild. She's a great lady. The track and stakes record. Number eight, Uzanaz was third. One, Nines Wild was fourth. The television graphic is incorrect. The 1996 winner of the Milton Stakes, number two, she's a great lady. Dexter Nukes, four-year-old four bay mare from Miss Donna Mayo, owned by the Linda and Lee DeVisser Partnership of Holland, Michigan, trained by Joe Holloway, and this year's Breeders' Crown Mare's Pace winner, the 1995 Fan Hanover Stakes winner, driven to victory by John Campbell. It's 5 and 11 this year. 152 in the Milton Stakes for She's a Great Lady. That's a track Canadian in stakes record. For mares on a 5 8 mile track, She's a Great Lady in 152 in the 1996 Milton Stakes. Thanks to the Mayor of Milton, His Worship Mr. Gord Krantz, for helping us out with the trackside presentation.